right Yo, the put the gun down now. Man on the ground. Gun pointed at him. Hey, hello, man. And unseen bystanders. We're not the ones pointing a gun at an unarmed man. Trying to de-escalate what they believe is a dangerous situation, playing out along a busy Salt Lake City street. At this point, an accident could happen. He's on the floor. There's a bunch of us out here. There's no need for you to be pointing a gun to a man's back. The video clip, posted to YouTube and LiveLeak.com, has quickly gone viral. Over 100,000 views and 11,000 comments in just four days on LiveLeak. But what is this? And why do officers not seem concerned at all with a guy pointing the gun? I never would have guessed that, that what happened before is actually what happened. Police say it's complicated. There's three different things going on in this case, and you, you can't make this stuff up. The man with the gun, cops say, is a security guard at a nearby Rite Aid who is known to police. He was following a suspected shoplifter when he came across something else. What he thought was an aggravated assault. He saw a male with a knife kick a bicycle with a ma another male on it and then brandish the knife. Cops say the man with the knife is the guy on the ground in the video. But here's a twist. On the other side of the story, the male that had the knife had actually, his bike was stolen. And he was out looking for his bike and he found his bike. Police say the man was confronting who he believed to be the bike thief just as the security guard pulled up. He took him down at gunpoint. Just in case he didn't catch it the first time. Amazingly, police say nobody was arrested. Not the guy with the gun who cops say acted legally. Not the guy who had the knife and not the bike thief. Neither one of them wanted to press charges on each other. The take home from this confusing tale? Police say it's an example why they always have to stay on their toes. You think you know what you're seeing when really what led up to it is completely different than what I thought.